We're going to be plotting a point, first of all, and then we need to find a point that is symmetric to the x-axis, symmetric to the y-axis, and symmetric to the origin. So if I choose a point, let's just say 4, comma, negative 2. That's my original point. Okay, I'm going to draw an x-y axis. Here's my x-axis. Label the y-axis. We're going to plot this point. 2, 3, 4, down 2. Alright, and we label our point 4, negative 2. Okay, let me get a few more lines on here. Now, if we're going to do, let's say, part A, symmetric to the x axis. Alright, to get a point that is symmetric across the x axis, I need to change the y coordinate. So all I do is just change the sign of the y coordinate. So I have 4, comma, positive 2. So when I plot that point right here, label it 4, comma, 2. This point is symmetric with the original point on the other side of the x-axis, symmetric with the respect to the x-axis. Okay, part B, we're going to do symmetric with respect to the y-axis. Now, since I want it to cross the y-axis, I need to change the sign of the x-coordinate using the original point. So I say negative 4, comma, I keep the y point, the coordinate the same. So negative 4, negative 2. And I plot this point, label, negative 4, negative 2, and this is part B. For part C, we are going to do symmetry with respect to the origin. Now, o -R -I. Okay, respect to the origin. Now, we have to change the sign of both the x and the y coordinates. So, we would have negative 4, comma, positive 2. Alright, so left to negative 4, up to positive 2. Put our point, label. And this is part C. And there we have it.